40 years ago, agriculture witnessed a revolutionary swing from hay to silage as a means of conserving forage for livestock. In the mid-80s, a further step forward was taken through the introduction of big bale silage using the Volac Silarap system. And Volac now introduced the next feed revolution that's set to change conventional livestock feeding as we know it. A system of preserving mature cereals grown on the farm and therefore fully traceable. A system that consistently produces high energy, zero effluent, cost effective natural forages that complement existing farm feedstuffs. A forage system that is eminently capable of supporting the genetic potential of modern livestock. This feed revolution is the Volac Alkalage system. In the next few minutes we'll show you the principles behind the production and feeding of hydrimatter alkaline preserved cereals harvested with a forager fitted with the revolutionary processing mill. Cereals harvested in this way and preserved using Volac home and dry are known as alkalages. Milling or grinding these cereals in a forage harvester fitted with a processing mill is known as primary processing. Traditionally, British and Irish dairy farmers have supplemented their low, dry matter, medium energy, home produced forages with bought in concentrates. For yields up to 7,000 litres, this system has been fine. But even at this level of production, where concentrate inputs are reduced around mid lactation, milk output may fall rapidly. The basal forage ration being unable to support yield. Sustaining outputs averaging 30 litres per head per day, as well as herd health and milk quality with traditional forage regimes, is well nigh impossible. But to survive at world milk prices, output per cow must increase, so that fewer dairy cattle and their followers will be required to produce any given quota of milk. The genetic makeup of the UK dairy herd is very different to that of 10 years ago. It is now inextricably linked to the North American Holstein. This new dairy animal is quite capable of extra production, providing she is fed correctly. And when fed correctly, she can easily maintain a much higher milk yield for longer. To produce these extra litres at an acceptable quality and still remain healthy, this new cow requires a radical.